maybe we are supposed to meet the wrong people before we meet the right ones. So when they finally arrive, we are truly grateful for the gift that we've been given. Maybe it's true we don't know what we lost until we lose it. But it's also true we don't know what we're missing until it arrives. Maybe the happiest of people don't have the best of everything. They make the best of everything that comes their way. Maybe the best kind of love is the kind where you sit on a sofa together, not saying a word, and walk away from the best conversation you've ever had. Maybe once in a lifetime you find someone who not only touches your heart, but also your soul. Someone who loves you for who you are, not what you can do. Maybe the art of true love is not about finding a perfect person, but about seeing an imperfect person. is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. It does not dishonor others. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily angered. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Love never fails. We gathered here today to celebrate with Matt and Alex Ernst and United Marriage. This is a beautiful and joyous occasion because it acknowledges their commitment and deep friendship and love. This is not a new love, but we've been tested, evolved, and matured over the years. Matt, the woman who stands by your side is about to become your wife. She will look to you for gentleness, for support, and for understanding, for encouragement, and for protection. You must never take Alex Ernst for granted and to be sensitive to the needs. Your life and love will be the greatest source of joy. So I ask you, Matt, will you have Alexandra be your wife? Will you love and cherish her? Will you always uphold and encourage her? Will you be loyal to her and true? Will you honor her all her days and be respectful? Will you promise to always bestow upon your heart's deepest devotion? Will you? By the power vested in me by the state of New York, with your Catholic Church, that I am once again pronouncing you as my wife. You may now see a proud of the kiss. Please kiss your bride. <laughs>